Okay, this should be short and sweet. The highlights from today's uh, chat session, greatstockpicks.com, October 19th. I'm going to show you the SPY real quick. Uh, you can see the huge gap down. We all saw it this morning. Well, then it broke its early five-minute high. It looked like it was going to run. Then it took out the lows of the day. These are five-minute candles. Then it takes out the highs of the day again. This is already strange action. Grind sideways, goes higher, and then takes out the low of the day altogether again with a little bounce at the end. So pretty tough action for me to find low-risk setups, all right? Uh, having said that, Sienna, using one of our newer methods, um, what we call early weakness plays, uh, called Sienna as a short. How's that for an arrow? Right there with a worst case stop. Right up here that never got hit, all right? Uh, and Sienna was, let me get the lines out of the way. Uh, the short idea was 13.94, um, and worst case stop, 14.01. So seven cents risk, and from 13.94, it did make it down to uh, 13.31, and that's literally all I have to brag about today. Um, really tough action for me to find any ideas. Uh, you know, we did, we did. Uh, I'll show you H and R block here. I was really stalking this one. Look at the daily on this, um, just straight down monster volume. Uh, somebody in the chat room said it's at nine-year lows today. Now, that doesn't matter. It doesn't mean it can't go lower. But uh, look at these daily candles. Now, switching to five-minute candles, um, we knew after a sell-off like that, we could get a real nice pop um, in H&R Block. If it could, here's the uh, early high I put in 11.15. Okay, right about here is where it just looked uh, ripe, right? Uh, the high here, let me get that line out of the way was 11.13, um, so I said if it breaks this base, 11.14, real good chance we get through the high of the day, which is only a couple pennies higher, and uh, and maybe short start to cover. But then as I scroll to the, as I scroll to the right, that's still not working. Let me try that again. Uh, you can see it uh, never did break that base and broke down instead, along with a lot of the rest of the market. Um, having said that, we did call it a couple times. Um, kind of as it was inching up here with with tight stops, but it just never could get through that high of the day. So I did get a couple um, a couple of losses in H&R uh, Block. They were all, I don't know, six, seven, maybe 10 cent stops, 10 cent stops, but uh, this one uh, gave me fits today. Looked beautiful right here though. Um, with that big sell-off it's had over this base, I just thought we were gonna rip. And then the market, of course, wasn't helping matters at all either. So uh, really Sienna, the only one to brag about. Uh, it caught a nice trade at the end of the day in MAS, um, not MAS, let me try it again, the letter M, Macy's. Uh, just a little break above this area, we caught this within five minutes of the low of the day. But it didn't, you know, it didn't move much, so it's not really worth bragging about. 22.57, and I think it made it to 72, and I sold into that pop. So I was really scraping for ideas today. Uh, and as I showed you on the SPY, pretty tough market. So hopefully uh, we'll be able to have a better highlight video tomorrow night. So have a good night. We'll talk to you later.